Hello everyone and welcome back to 13 Nights Halloween. I am back with Toast and we are here with more Devil May Cry 1. That was very quick. <laughs> Why are you breaking apart the illusion, Toast? <laughs> what illusion? I swear, you disappear from recording videos for four years and you completely forget how to do it. Same. Hey, I, 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 rec I record video. I yeah, technically I do. I haven't uploaded anything in a hot minute. I just record me getting perfects on a fucking uh, Japanese-only rhythm game. I see you uh, comment on my brother's video saying, when are you going to play a real game? <laughs> I mean, is Flying Gorilla a real game? It's possibly the realest game. He's I, doing... I, still, I, I still think Flying Gorilla... Big conspiracy. Easy automatic mode. In this mode, you'll be able to perform and enjoy many different moves with specific controls. With just one button, you'll be able to perform many different sword actions depending on the situation. If you're able to fire without pressing R1 to aim. Plus, by holding down the fire button, you'll be able to rapid fire. From here on, they you'll be really able hit to you with the easy mode is now so. They, they said you suck. Hey, first of all, <laughs> I'm gonna click no. Power up. See? There are power ups. Devil Star, Vital Star, Holy Water. But none of these are like moves. Do I even need any of these? No, right? Uh, those are usable items. Uh. Yeah, but I don't need blue, it. Blue orbs are good. Blue orbs are your HP pretty much. You get blue orbs, you get more HP. You get four blue orb fragments, you get a blue orb. I didn't have enough. Which increases your HP. Um, that shop but reminds me it. of the shop from Beautiful Joe. Except for Beautiful Joe had more cool stuff. Because it lets you buy moves right away. Now, if you want to see a game where I'm good at it, and I can combo it and get beautiful combos, it's that game. Bang, bang, bang. You Look should be, uh, kind of enemy coming up on your first, uh, good weapon. Ooh. Oh, this, this, this sword isn't good? Uh, so... Every other weapon you get in this game, you can use what's called Devil Trigger, which we'll, you'll see once you get it. Uh, you know about Devil Trigger. Yeah, it's from the song. I'll be able to play the song. Yeah. Oh, no, job. you get to use it in a really called Devil Trigger. Oh, but, that's uh, not as good for, as some, for some reason, I don't know. It's probably explained and I've never looked it up. Uh, Dante cannot go into Devil Trigger with your default sword in Force Edge. Really? Uh, every other weapon you get in DMC1, you can. Actually, I don't know if you're able to, to use it with the last. Uh, the main two you use at least, and you're gonna get a new sword, and then later on you get gauntlets, which they tend to stay pretty similar throughout the series. I need to get the fuck away from these guys. Just like a fight. Look honestly, at that! Oh, hey, got this. Good shit. That's the good shit. You know why? Because I'm oh, actually. Can combo. I'm actually awesome at this game. <laughs> I've been hiding it this entire time. There's a painting of a middle-aged man. Okay. There's a sculpture of a female in agony with a sword pierced through her chest. Wait, I can hear a voice. I am Alistair. The weak shall give your heart to the swear their eternal loyalty to me. Oh, is this the sword? Why did the sword stab him? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh... Dante probably chooses the worst way to get out of this. <laughs> Does he go through it all? Oh he my might. god. It's such a bad fucking idea. 
Oh, uh, perks, perks of being a half demon. Oh. It's fucking doing the matrix. Don't 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 How am I supposed to it's believe? So it? stupid, but I love this. He can put a sword through his chest, but he can't stand up to a bunch of puppets. Oh, by the way, yeah, his clothes don't rip. I don't know what's up with that. It's because his uh, clothes are from the PS2, Zen. Uh, not Zen. Toast. Sorry, it's late. <laughs> it is a PS2 game. Yeah. He really did play techno when he got the sword. Fucking juggles it with his feet. Welcome to your new default weapon. Force Edge fucking sucks. Do I have any more combos? I think it's just kind of electricity Force Edge. Really? In terms of combos. Oh, but you said However, I get, uh. I get Devil Trigger now, right? Yes. So once you see that new bar under your HP meter. Yes. Uh, you beat up enough enemies, it'll fill up. Uh, you fill up at least three, and press, I think it could be L1. Well, let's find out. You can go into Devil Trigger. Now you just need to find some enemies. Hello? Oh, God. Was this the way I came in? Yes. Yeah. Camera. I can see a room on the other side. There must be another way to get there. But how is the good question? I realize <laughs> watching you play this, they explain literally fucking nothing to you. No, they don't explain shit. I kind of miss it. I kind of miss these type of games. I, I always love figuring out how to do stuff. Just play Dark Souls. What Dark Funnily Souls enough, is. I have Dark Souls 1 through 3 on Steam. Guess who hasn't played it? You. Yeah. Uh, Dark Souls is designed like a PS2 game, so they don't tell you yeah. anything. Yeah. I've well, I've played Bloodborne. I can say that much. Yeah, Bloodborne is, is kind of Bloodborne is similar. It's also kind of baby mode because it you is. get a ranged parry. It's also the best. Why they gave you games. a ranged parry? I don't know. It's also, funny enough, it's fun. it's not baby mode because uh, there's no shields, but yeah. there are shields in Dark Souls. And maybe using the shield is the most baby thing in all of Dark Souls. If you bother learning enemy attacks, it's baby mode because you can just shoot at them from a distance. See, that's the way you're supposed to play Dark Souls, but most people just, you know, shield, backstab, done, or use magic. Which is what I do, I just use magic. <laughs> I got time for this game. You might have to go back. Really? Yeah. Okay, don't... Don't just give me the life story, I don't care. <laughs> Come on, this is definitely Resident Evil. Whee! I mean, where else do I go? There's another door right, that's gonna be on your left. Right here? Yep. Yeah. Oh, right here. There you go. You solved it. He's about to experience the devil. Oh, devil trick. Oh, okay. I think this game's actually kind of awesome now. <laughs> Maybe you were right. Game three one is fun. Uh, I lost my double trigger. 
I think the, the thing I'm that was... I'm pretty sure eventually you can buy an upgrade for Alistair that lets you fly and double trigger. You can shoot fucking electricity with your guns. Can I shoot? Yeah! Shoot electricity! <laughs> <laughs> this is kind of cool. Dude, I'm just glad I got someone to like the MC1. <laughs> I mean, again, this is pretty awesome. Like, I can't deny a game that lets you shoot lightning and turn into a demon man is anything but cool. Yeah. Definitely will say, uh, 3 is a lot more enjoyable, but goddamn, I still love 1. It is a really good first game. I really hope uh, that we get a DMC six. I don't know. It we sold will. well, didn't it? DMC five sold really well. Yeah. Yeah. I it mean, that was a contender like, for game of the year. Definitely was for that year. It was a lot. I'm I think that was sure a that... of pretty good games that year too, from what I can remember. Yeah. It's really the light game gun. <laughs> it's what drives it over the top. So, let's see, I'm looking it up now. Uh... Fools. It wasn't, like, an actual Game of the Year contender at the Game Awards. It did win, a uh, Best Action Game for 2019, though. I mean, but when you consider Best Game, it, it what were the other things on that list, and I'll tell you whether or not they deserve. For I will use Best my Action skill. Game or Game of the Year? Game of the Year. And I'm game gonna, of the Year, yeah. Had, yeah, Sekiro. Uh-huh. Uh, Control. Death Stranding, Outer Worlds, RE2 Remake, and Smash Ultimate. Okay, so we all know, get Death Stranding off of there. <laughs> it does not belong. Get that off of there. I would say get Outer Worlds out of there. I've heard it's a very okay I do, game. Don't, there, it depends on which one, because it, it, there's two types of games. There's the Outer Wilds and the Outer Worlds. The Outer Worlds is the, uh, it's the one made by Obsidian. It's similar to Fallout. Yeah, but then there's the Outer Wilds, which is like the time travel one. Outer World is not the time travel one. I can say that much. It it was made. Really? Outer Worlds was the kind of tried to be uh, New Vegas, considering Obsidian made New Vegas. Oh, I'm stupid. From what I recall. Don't worry, they don't tell you fucking anything. Um. In the outer, I think the outer wilds, the one that Obsidian made, there's a character with a moon face that you can talk to, and he works for the corporation. And he goes like, "Staff of Judgment, is this a weapon?" I'm gonna say no based off there being no cutscene. But there's a dude who you can ask like, "Are you happy with your current life situation?" And you can keep talking to him, and he'll get aggressively more. He'll get more and more like, uh, my corporation does not allow me to uh, speak. <laughs> you know, you know that um, that character from Undertale, the one who works at the burger place. Yeah. He's like that, but voiced and wearing a moon mask. <laughs> so you could push him to the breaking point. He goes like, "What the hell do you want me to say, man? Do you want something from me? <laughs> Just leave <laughs> me alone and enjoy your burger from the lovely corporations that exist here." <laughs> I really, I, I honestly really hope we get up to the first boss. Let's try. I don't think it'll be too long. I don't know. What are these scissors? Clock tower bastards? Yeah. Eat lightning. Oh, wait. Because, uh... I actually don't remember if I ever... Actually, yeah, I said I did make it to a part with a, um, counter of some kind. Oh. Eat lightning. Cool. It's 
mission four. I don't know what mission you're on right now. I think I'm on mission one at least. Oh, I don't want to kill. I think you're past one for sure. Yeah, we hit, we hit one. Jump back down. Do we have to go back? To Honestly, the... this game is kind of short. How long is if it? If you know what you're doing, definitely you can beat it quickly. I wish I remembered how to do the juggle up, because that would actually help a whole bunch with certain puzzles. Uh, lock on and hold down when you're... Oh, I see. Yeah. And I'm pretty sure if you hold up, you get a, uh, lunge. It's called stinger, it's your, like, lunge forward. Do we I do it at the same time, by the way? Like, do I hit the hit attack button at the same time that I hit the... Launcher? I, I usually will be holding, like, like, what do you mean? Just make sure you kind of cut out a little bit. Ah, it's fine. I'll figure it out. If I understand what you're saying, I usually hold the, uh, like, up or down, like, before hitting. Yes, I, you're getting what I'm saying. Yeah, I usually hold it for a quick second and then hit attack. It, I don't usually. I think you can do it at the same time. Ow. Damn. It hurt. Boy, it hard. Unfortunately, uh, he can't handle the lightning. I tried to shoot him like a coward. There we go. He will not be listening to the Hit Metallica song, Ride the Lightning. He will not. Alright, where do I go from here? Is it up here? I think it might be. There's a door over there. To your right. To my right? Yeah, like in the, on that middle platform. That's a door. I was about to say, no, my, my right? What, the camera's right? <laughs> camera's right. Like, go back. I, I know where where to go. Yeah. It's right here. Well, there is a door there, but I was also talking about the middle platform. <laughs> no, I tried. It, it, it wouldn't let me go. Ah. The thing I'm trying to do is shoot them upward and sh uh, hit them upward and then start shooting. You want to juggle them? Tell you, once I learned how to devil trigger, everything has been much easier. The guiding soul gather. All right, so let me see. Handguns, action. Oh, you can! I, I forgot you actually can see shit. Hold time. Kick jump. Roll. Devil trigger. This. Can I use it? Oh, this isn't. <clears throat> So usually, if you have what the what the thing asks for, you'll pretty much like automatically use it. So if you pretty much would not have the item there if it's not giving you a prompt to put it in. Hey, I guess I gotta go back to where I was beforehand. Keep going, I guess. Yeah, try interacting with the like weird energy field. Oh yeah, you're right. I should try that. Bam! You know what this combat actually kind of reminds me of? What? I think there's some of this in Yakuza, isn't it? Where you delay attacks and do something different. Stylish. I think I, I, think I recall something like that. It's hard to say because I haven't touched Yakuza in over a year. Ow. Okay. 
It's a statue of an angel. It guardian of God. Where to go, Toast? Where to go? <laughs> Where? I'm sorry. We went through the middle. Oh, right here, right? right doing? Yeah. There's something written. Only those who Lion has accepted can set me free. We are not accepted by Lion Toast. Oh, this is another angel statue. Oh, but that did do something. Did it? Yeah. I think you just summoned well, more skeletons. I heard a noise. Guys. You might just jump down anyway. See. See. Die. Maybe it's this fountain. Nope. It was worth the shot. I really thought I was gonna make that. Gonna be honest, thought I was gonna make that sweet jump. I feel like the light staff has to deal with that, right? What else could it be dealing with? Mm, let's go back and check, I guess. Leave me alone, I don't care. Oh god. I think, I think I know where to go. Yeah, go down that uh, thing again. Yeah, it's likely I just missed where I had to use the item. Or there was something else down there. I think you missed where to use the item. Yeah, because there was some other stuff in this room, right? There's like a weird devil statue. It's gone now. That's the exit. Mm. Mm. Oh, there we go. I hear I hear you now. Where'd it go? I just froze for like a couple minutes. Um Maybe It's hard to say because if I go further down, I haven't gone this way yet. Later. Oh wait, wait, wait. Wait, go no, back. No, go back. Go. Try. There's a door on the right. Is there? Like far back, right? I'm pretty sure. I oh, think I so. I see something. Yeah. Sneaky door. There is your door. What is it? Power up? Alistair. Ooh. What can we get? Nothing. Oh no, we can get Stinger <laughs> level 1. Yeah. So now, so that's your, like, if you hold forward and, like, with lock on attack. That's what I was talking about. You have to fly in the fucking air. Alright. So, I don't know if there's anything else in this room, though. I don't know if there is. Alright, we're going to pause, and we're going to end the video, and then we will find out where to go from here. <laughs> so, join us for <laughs> we'll the next video. For more 13 nights. Say goodbye, Toast. See ya.